Good morning, YouTube. This is Crazy Orchid Lady, and it is Saturday morning. Uh, cleanup's still kind of going on. You'll hear uh, buzz saws and things like that. Um, roofing companies doing some repair work. Um, but I was out having my usual morning coffee, and we've pretty much gotten everything cleaned up here. Um, the back's still a bit of a mess, but me and my husband have been repairing our back roof ourselves um, because copay is ridiculous and the roofing materials were way cheaper and we've done the work before. Uh, it's hard work but we did it again and it's done. Uh, don't have to wait for insurance adjusters, uh, as a matter of fact still waiting for them. Um, but at least we know that's done and, uh, and we're okay. But uh, another blow today so everything's in my porch is looking great it's not my orchids um, got several orchids hanging on this side but that's not the reason for the video so apparently in my pond this morning I came out and I smelled something really foul and I found all my fish belly up yeah it wasn't pretty um, there was one fish that was still moving. And I quickly scooped them out and put them in some um, reverse osmosis water that we have for our salt water tank with a little bit of, um, it's like a tank uh, slime coat starter type thing, which I happen to have. So I put a little bit of drops in there and I quickly scooped them up and put them in there. He looked a little bit, um, I don't know, off. He was kind of swimming weird. Um, but it's been about 30 minutes and he looks so much better. So I'm thinking that there was so much roofing debris in here and just debris in general because the t this, this pond has gone completely green on me. It's almost like it's cycling again and uh, the ammonia probably just spiked ridiculously. So all of my fish are gone. My algae eaters are gone. Um, so not, not a great thing to wake up to this morning. But, uh, you know, I guess part of the process. Luckily, it was just goldfish. Uh, we have cranes around here, so I'm, I don't put anything but the feeder goldfish in there. Uh, kind of sucks, though, because they, they were big, but it's all right. Um, so for now, we have one goldfish in the house, in a bowl, uh, to care for until we kind of get this figured out. Um, but, yep. So, just another, uh, another Irma surprise. Uh, on the bright side though, I got several alerts this morning uh, and a cautionary tale when you're stuck in the house for, you know, four or five days and can't go anywhere because the stores are closed and the restaurants are closed and the streets are crazy um, and you have power and internet, well, you will shop. So, uh, and I'm not a shopper, but I did shop. And I got all my alerts today that apparently everything I ordered will be coming in today. Which is really bizarre because they were all ordered at really, really different times. I'm kind of worried about a couple of the packages. Uh, they are or all orchids. Um, while people were getting prepared for the hurricane and there was nothing we could do, I decided to just kind of sit and chill and check out eBay and I put in minimum bids on several offers and what do you know I won a lot of them so I will be receiving several packages today um, of orchids that I that I got um, great fantastic deals I, uh, I mean I literally got orchids for 99 cents plus the shipping which is like five dollars so um, ones that you can't find in stores and I got uh, one that was pretty rare um, as well, so I'm really excited about it. I've been wanting to get one for a while. Again, for a steal. So, uh, a little bit of good news uh, this morning as well. So, looking forward to that later this afternoon. I will see, depending on how the day goes, if I do film an unboxing video for you because it's going to be multiple boxes. Um, but yeah, so just, uh, just another day in paradise, what can I tell you? Anyway, uh, everybody have a great rest of your day, and uh, hope we talk to you guys later. Thank you so much. Have a good day.